one rule only when it comes to this game. Get in and get out. I knew what I was doing when I stepped off in this game. I knew the consequences when I... Prime 22. What's up, everybody? This is Richie Gray Triple from 90 Baby Cartel. Now, Prime 22. Go and check out prime22.com. Get those photo shoots and those video shoots booked. I got something special for y'all today. I'm here with the one and only future Sanford Mayor 2022, Chan Robinson. It's a pleasure having you. Yeah, I appreciate you. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure having you. Uh, I'm very excited. I'm probably more excited than him that he's running for mayor. Uh, tell him a little bit about yourself, Chan. Oh, of course. Um, uh, thank you for tuning in for first off. Uh, my name is Chan Robinson. I'm from Sanford, Florida. Born and raised. Uh, lived here my whole life. Uh, you know, I went to Lake Mary High School. I went, grew up, went to Goldsboro Elementary, Hamilton Elementary. You know, I've always been a part of the community. Grew up in Goldsboro. Uh, I have a bachelor's, I have a master's. We're pursuing a second bachelor's right now. Where did you go to college? In film, I uh, went to FIU. Okay. Down in Miami. Yeah. It was good, I ran Division One track down there. Did good enough in high school, and um, you know, prior to uh, dropping out, you know, to run for mayor last time in 2014, was running track down there, and it was great. Great oh, atmosphere. Man, that's what's I loved up, it. Man. So, I mean, you didn't really tell us about your father, uh, you know, your mother, you know, a very prominent family here in Sanford, man. Uh, Thank you. I appreciate that, bro. It means sure. a, gotta put means that a lot. Yeah. In the household growing up, uh, just got to say it was strict. You know, my mom's a deputy sheriff with Seminole County. She's been a deputy sheriff for what? Big shout out to Marcy. Almost 20 years herself. Actually, a little over 20 years now. Dang. Yeah. Time flies. For real. And uh, father has been in the military for 22 years in the Army National Guard. So... Good to say it was, uh, to Good say stop. the least, it was a strict household. Yeah. Kept you on the right path. No, definitely. For sure. Kept you on your toes. All of y'all, I mean, all the brothers went to college, like, all of them. So, I mean, that's just good First parenting. generation. And that's uh, you know I mean? something I give my mom and dad um, for sure. a lot of accolade for, is, you Every know, raising four, four African-American, you know what I mean, children in, in low-income Housing, low-income right communities, in the hood. And right in the hood. Four for four. <laughs> yeah. To college, yes, and all four for four scholarships. So you heard that athletic scholarships. Athletic so that's, scholarships uh, too. You know, Reggie was that guy. Everybody know Reggie Robinson now. Quarterback yeah. number two. Quit playing late, Mary. <laughs> yeah. I was always. I felt like I was always the most slept on athlete, but I still went D one. <laughs> I still went D one. He he was that's the most how, slept on the, though. Let's be real though. That Nobody, was the goal. Oh, hey, we're D1, no. though. You can't take that away from me. <laughs> awesome, though. You can't, awesome. can't take that. I did, I'm not going to lie. I did get beat, though. As soon as I got to college, um, my freshman year, yeah. I was boys from Florida State and Bethune Ooh, and smoke. Auburn and North Carolina. They were getting me. Mm. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's get back into the main issues here. Um, he is running for mayor of Sanford, Florida. Um, tell us what you're going to be doing for Sanford. You know, I think we need to uh, step into the year 2022 and actually promote our city and, and compete with cities like Orlando, you know, these larger than life cities. We got our airport. Straight up. We got a booming downtown. Mm -hmm. You know, I think we're missing a few different things, like a parking garage to facilitate larger events. You know, we have a city manager system okay. where the city manager is effectively the CEO. So, uh, you know, we have a whole department. He has a whole cabinet. And, you know, to get anything done, it takes... Uh, a lot of teamwork, a lot of collaboration. There's no one person that makes decisions. Yeah. So there's a lot of the bigger things, you know, take months and sometimes years to accomplish. But if we're talking short term, I would have to, one of the leading issues would be marketing. Okay. I think um, that's something that could be affected in days. Yeah. You know, simple, uh, it might sound silly at first, but social media, you know, campaigns. I think Sanford's on the right track right now. And my election, my campaign is not a referendum on fixing something that's broken. Mine is, I think we're running, I want to run faster. I think the energy, I think it's a perfect time right now to have a, a young, educated millennial. Um, 
the city's a business, and just like uh, your bakery down the street needs to the proper advertising on social media, whether it's uh, mail, whether it's TV. Yeah. You need uh, you need the similar marketing for your city, and you got to treat it the same. Hey, I'm loving the vision. First of all, if you're not seeing it, just think. Look at that innovation. You need somebody. But that's something that could be affected, man. That's something that could be affected. Right affected away, soon. simple stuff like that. Marketing Getting a new strategy. logo for Sanford. If new you want to like talk that, short term, that's something yeah. that uh, on day one I would I want to get with with whoever's in charge of of every aspect of, of video marketing. What is our name? How do we rebrand? What color should should this advertisement be? Everything. Uh, so uh, once again, I want to thank you guys for viewing me today and um, just giving me a chance to tell my side of the story. My name is Chan Robinson. I'm running for mayor of Sanford. Yeah, you can go to my website if you want more information at chanrobinson.com. Chanrobinson.com. Uh, you can go there and you know <laughs> if you want to reach out and support. If you want to reach out and ask me a question, I'm always there. If you want to meet, just message me. We can go have coffee, and I'll love to sit down with you and tell you. Uh, more specifically about my platform or answer any questions on issues that you got. Uh, you know, I'm here. I want to be here. I'm in, I'm engaged. We're locked in on this election. Yes, uh, I feel really good about it. We got hey, a good man. team around he us. He came to a the lot hood. of support. Came uh, to my office. Uh, you know, I've been seeing Chan really doing his thing. I think it's his year. It's his time. Uh, we need this. You know, we need some, some new blood in there. Nobody's saying that, you know, I mean, I've been happy. I'm good. I'm, I don't. I never really care about politics, but I know, getting older, that it's time now for us as the, the generation to to kind of step up into that new leadership role. So I mean, I'm proud to be behind you, uh, and definitely want to see you win. I appreciate you, man. Yes, thank you for having me on. Hey, thank you for coming. Yeah. You can do good this year. Yes, sir.